Hello everybody and a very warm welcome to the channel. Well it's finally here, World Update 13. Today is a short video on how to update the application and how to disable your community folder that may stop any of them little bugs creeping into the system. So without any delay, let's get into it. So the first thing first we need to do is go to the start menu and go to the Microsoft Store app. It'll come up with a screen. Then go to the tab up the top and say get updates. As you can see, Microsoft Flight Simulator is already here. So I'm just going to continue downloading it. And then it disappears. Close Microsoft Store. Now you have to navigate to your community folder. All you simply need to do is rename it. In this case, dot old. And what that will do is it will tell Microsoft Flight Simulator that you do not have a community folder that can be corrupted. And now close that down and open Microsoft Flight Simulator. So we'll open with the normal loading screen and then the next stage will prompt you to do the latest update. Now the update is 970 megabytes and it will tell you where it's going to install the community folder. Press update and let's do its thing. So the application has updated itself. What I always do, just as a matter of precaution, is I run it with no add-ons on whatsoever, just to make sure that the community folder is not affected. Depending how powerful your computer is or your SSD will determine how long it stays on the loading screen for. So here we are in the main menu. So the next thing to do is go down to Marketplace. Click on World, and it'll show you down here World Update, and it's free. So all you do is click on that, get and download, and it should start downloading, which is 9.68 gigabytes, so it's quite a big update. So there you go, it's installed, so the next stage is, so go to the home screen, so exit the application completely. Go back into your community folder. As you can see, Microsoft Flight Simulator has already made another community folder, but it will be completely empty if we open it up like so. So all we need to do, delete that one, then rename this old community folder back to community. And that's it. Close that down and then restart the simulator. By reactivating your community folder, it may take several minutes for the simulator to kick in properly. So please be patient, it is working. So here we are. So if you just want to double check, just to make sure that it actually has been installed, go to activities. Go to Discovery Flights and right down at the bottom, as it's the new update, there should be Hawaii and other points of interest, as you can see. Then also go back just to make sure your community folder is up to date. Go on the world map and Check if all your airplanes uh, are in there. Uh, if so, then it looks like it's actually been taken effect. Then click close, home, and that's it guys. 
All you need to do is just double check, make sure that everything's been installed properly again. There may be several updates from developers in the, in the future with the new world update. So keep your eye out for that. I hope you found this informative and easy to follow. Remember to like, comment and subscribe. And if there's anything that you need to know more, please put them in the comment section below. Until next time, take care. Bye bye for now.